Coming up next, new news in the ITN News Headlines. Thank you very much for repairing my tire. Thank you very much, thank you very, very, very much. Thank you very much for the loan of your dryer. Thank you very, very, very much. Cadbury's Roses, their favorite centers, all lavishly covered in delicious Cadbury's chocolate. Make roses the sweetest way to say, Thank you very much, you're one in a million. Thank you very much, thank you very, very, very much. Thank you very much for feeding William. Thank you very, 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 very Say it very, with very, Cadbury's Roses. name change take two action cats make haste for the brekkies taste the brekkies taste makes cats make haste brekkies the new name for munchies settlers tums fast effective indigestion relief in three pleasant tasting fruit flavors tum, 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 tum. You dirty old man. He can't take Katie in there for a Homston build. Well, he needn't look at me as if I'd made an improper suggestion. Well, what's a draft lager like in town? Liquid underneath of them. Sort of dried crust on top. Rather like a moldy rice pudding. Get your kids off, Katie! Katie weighs all of two tons, remember? Ah, don't look! Too late. Homston pills, a sugar turns to alcohol production. Coming up after the news is the latest instalment in Return to Eden. Well, last week, Steffi struggled to regain control of the Harper Mining Company. In the process, however, she became more estranged from Dr. Dan, particularly when the lovely Jilly told him that Amal was the father of Steffi's first child. Well, you remember him. He was adopted by Bill McMasters. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you more after the ITN news headlines. There's been furious reaction in the Commons and since to the Chancellor's budget tax cuts. His announcement of tuppence off the basic rate was interrupted by a Scottish nationalist who was suspended. And Mr Lawson's announcement of 20 pence off the top rate of tax was greeted with chants of shame by Labour MPs. Conservatives are calling it an historic budget. Labour say it put greed before need. He offered nothing at all to the National Health Service. Yeah. And by comparison, with his handout to the richest in Britain, offered a puny, marginal, negligible amount to those who constitute the average people. Most of the people after the social security reviews in April will be materially better off. Most disabled people, for example, whom all of us would wish to see better off, will be better off by about £5 a week as a result of those changes. It's a budget which very clearly, sharply divides those who are well off, particularly the higher rate taxpayers, the sudden reduction from 60% to 40%, much more than anyone expected, uh, as against the poorer in society. In the American primary election in Illinois, Vice President George Bush has won a big victory over his main rival, Bob Dole, according to exit polls. Amongst the Democrats, it's predicted Senator Paul Simon has beaten Jesse Jackson. Simon had failed to win any of the previous 28 Democratic primaries or caucuses. He said he would quit the race if he did not finish first here on his home ground. Bob Dole's defeat could spell the end of his campaign. The Swindon Town footballer Chris Kamara is to become the first English league player to appear in court charged with a criminal offence following an on-pitch incident. 29-year-old Kamara has been summoned to appear before Shrewsbury magistrates on April the 14th He's accused of causing grievous bodily harm to the Shrewsbury player Jim Mel Rose after the second division match between Shrewsbury and Swindon. Cricket on the, in the third one-day match against New Zealand, England failed to capitalise on a fine century by Chris Broad. It was his first in one-day internationals and he made 106. England were bowled out for 219 in the 48th over. 
Their last four wickets went for only 33 runs. That's all for now. I'll be back a little bit later in the morning. See you then. On Anglia, entertainment for Wednesday right through the night. At 10.45, film action with Robert Mitchum as the ambassador, caught in a web of scandal and blackmail. At half past midnight, international one-day cricket, England versus New Zealand, followed at 1.30 by Tales from the Dark Side. At 2 a.m., comedy in Three's Company, and with appointment with fear, once upon a time man, nostalgia 50 years on, and then ITN's morning news, that's Wednesday right through the night here on Anglia. The climax of Return to Eden came last week when Steffi managed to get enough money and shares to oust the dastardly Jake. Then he decides to ask her to marry him, and then he confesses he's sold half a mining. What next? Get the idea, get, get the idea, get the idea. The Daily Mail Ideal Home Exhibition has thousands of ideas to make your ideal home. There are also six great show houses, and thousands of prizes can be won for your ideal home in the Daily Mail's new £250,000 casino game. Play every day in the Daily Mail. Get there. Real Design gel. Sculpt. Control for any shape. Fixing spray. Directional. Create a style. Sculpting mousse. Stronghold. Be bold the way you like it. Create your look. Buying a house is one of the most important decisions you'll ever make. That's why, if you're searching for your very first home, you should be looking for a special kind of mortgage. The TSB Home Buyer's Plan. Just one of many mortgage plans now available from TSB. Ring now for details. chocolate orange, smooth milk or plain chocolate with real oil of orange. How safe is yours? Ooze Valley Motors of St. Ives in Bedford are currently offering the famous Fiat Uno, Europe's most wanted small car. And to celebrate the start of 1988, for the weekly equivalent of £19.88, APR 7.93%, you could be the proud owner of a brand new Uno. Visit Ooze Valley Motors of St. Ives in Bedford. I want to grow up in a place where people don't mug other people. I want to grow up where kids don't sniff glue. I want to grow up in the street where my grand can open the front door without being frightened. No one breaks in our house and steals our things. I want to grow up on an estate where the big kids don't go around smashing things up and where my sister can walk home safely without being worried by horrible men. I want to grow up on a... Is this too much to ask? A lot of people think it isn't. Without the radio getting nicked. People are already working together to crack crime. Why not join in? Start here. This book is full of ideas to help you, the police, all of us. Protect our family, our property, our community. Phone 01 200 1000 for your free copy now. Please.
Please, please. Please. Crime. Together we'll crack it. You'll be off your nanny to look at any other telly. Hitachi televisions. The ones with the free five-year guarantee. How can you be certain that the oil you give your engine is doing everything you expect of it? Protecting every moving part. Ensuring maximum performance every time. Here's a way. Make sure the oil is liquid engineering. Castrol GTX. Fit it in your engine. Get the idea. Get, get the idea. Get the idea. The Daily Mail Ideal Home Exhibition has thousands of ideas to make your ideal home. There are also six great show houses, and thousands of prizes can be won for your ideal home in the Daily Mail's new £250,000 casino game. Play every day in the Daily Mail. Get there.